Hi, my name is Niven. I'm Citrix Engineer. In this video, I will explain you how to enable HTML5 in Citrix Zoom Desktop 7.6 to access virtual desktops from a HTML5 enabled web browser. It includes three steps. First, enable receiver for HTML5 in Citrix storefront. Second, enable ICA WebSockets connections policy in Citrix Studio. Third, verify HTML5 by access desktop and application using web browser. Let's start with step one. Enable receiver for HTML5 in Citrix storefront. Open the Citrix Studio Management Console. Click on receiver for web. In the middle pane, make sure the appropriate store is selected. In the right pane, under Actions, click Deploy Citrix Receiver. To enable receiver for HTML5, there are three options. Install locally. Use receiver for HTML5 if local install fails. Always use receiver for HTML5. Select use receiver for HTML5 if local install fails. Step 2. Enable ICA WebSockets Connections Policy in Citrix Studio. Enable WebSockets Policies using the Citrix Studio Management Console. The WebSockets Policy Settings for Accessing Virtual Desktops and Hosted Applications with Receiver for HTML5. The WebSockets feature increases security and reduces overhead by conducting two-way communication between browser-based applications and servers without opening multiple HTTP connections. Under Citrix Studio, go to Policy. In the middle pane, under Policies, either modify an existing policy or create a new policy. In the right pane, under Actions, Edit Policy. Edit Unfiltered Window opens. Type WebSockets and hit Enter. It will filter you all the three WebSockets related policy settings. Click select for all of them. Select allowed and click OK. Leave default, click OK. Leave default, click OK. Click next. Enter a policy name or leave default. Make sure enable policy is tick marked. Click finish. Step 3. 
verify HTML file by access desktop and application using web browser. Login via storefront URL and this Windows machine have no Citrix receiver installed. When you see this page, click on log on. You get this page when you select use receiver for HTML5. If local install fails, that means you have two options. First, Citrix Receiver Plugin. Second, Receiver for HTML5. And the appropriate username and password. The page will enumerate all the apps and desktops you have access to. Click on any of the application and see it will launch in a browser. Hope you find this video informative. Thanks for watching this video.